Hello everyone, welcome back to another replay commentary. On this video I've got Mark 2909 in his FV4202 for you. One of those tanks that are not the best for the average player. Yet it is uh, one tank that is also very challenging but also very rewarding. A lot of fun to play. And really, you really have to think about what you want to do with this tank. As you do not have any turret armor at all and uh, yeah, basically comparable to the 140 but uh, you have uh, a good hull armor indeed it is um, very angled and very strong so you can bait a lot of shots with that but uh, yeah that's not uh, nothing reliable it's just uh, a bonus uh, sometimes you bounce some things there but uh, yeah you should not count on that so but what makes this tank great is the premium hash. It does uh, lack some high penetration premium ammunition like heat or IPCR as other tanks have. But you have the high penetration HE. So if you get behind some enemies or to the sides, you can hammer out um, 440 alpha with only 6.4 seconds reload on the rammer. So this makes this tank a, a lot of fun to play. Then also uh, the, H, the HE of course has um, some better module damage as other ammunition types have. So uh, even though he doesn't have the high armor, uh, I mean turret armor, sorry, he's still working the mid here and trying to get in some shots, keep the enemies busy, keep them spotted. As you may know, this is one of the best positions you can have. And probably one of the best positions on any map is you are in the middle of the map, uh, high down and can shoot to so many angles. You can basically shoot anywhere. And um, so you can easily back off again and get into cover. But still, um, for example, on the other side here, you will uh, not be able to run that fast. Uh, also, especially when your team moves into the C corner, which is on the top right here. But um, as long as you do not get uh, focused so hard, you can do a lot of damage from this position. So that's what he does here. He just tries to get some shots in and yeah, tries to play some safe shots. <laughs> now the Sheridan is, a weird, is doing a weird yellow move and he's getting pushed by the A3 also. I really like what he does here. He is just um, trying to get below the gun depression of the E3. You can see him just aiming over him and yeah, E3 missed his chance to shoot. He gets past him and ignores the E3 as he's still at risk of getting pushed. He does the same thing with the 704. He tracks him and just leaves him in place, he doesn't care about him. The standard B is very more dangerous to him at this point. So he just um, tries to get the standard B and uh, yeah, with the hash he can penetrate and he can kill him but some other one helps him out here, wasn't necessary but still. And again he's getting pushed and um, ignores the 704 again and goes over to farm the E3 from behind as he's low HP. Also Ice 4 still aiming at him. So that's already something that you can take away from this replay. If someone's focusing you hard, just ignore him and uh, try to shoot some other people. As, um, yeah, a one versus one just takes a lot of time and uh, is often very, very risky for you. And even if you are the better player, it's just uh, RNG dependent. So <laughs> 1v1 is not perfect for anyone. So you just uh, ignore those that try to get you and shoot the others. So you keep one gun busy, keep one gun out of the fight and help your team a lot more. Killing the others and then you are again with the team against the one that you are fighting or that's fighting you. So in only 5 minutes or so he already does 8400 damage almost 
as you may know this tank uh, is really great for doing a lot of damage in very short amount of time and this video is great at showing that so i hope you enjoyed this video only a short one more videos coming soon thanks mark for sending that in thank you all for watching hope you enjoyed see you